In this video, you will learn the basics of how to take a quiz in Moodle. For this tutorial, we will look at one quiz example. The icon for a quiz looks like a green clipboard with white lines. Click to open the quiz. Once open, you will see important details about the quiz and how it has been configured by your instructor. In this example, there are five allowed attempts, the quiz has an open and close date, there is a one hour time limit and you will receive the score for your highest grade. There are a variety of question types that you may see when taking a Moodle quiz including multiple choice, true false, short answer, numeric questions and more. To begin the quiz select attempt quiz now. Read any notifications that pop up on the screen and then start attempt. The questions will dis be displayed on the screen and since there is a time limit, the clock over to the right will begin ticking down. This quiz has two questions shown on the screen. Some instructors set up questions so that only one question is shown on each page, but in this case both are shown on the first screen. Your instructor will also select quiz settings. The selected settings dictate whether you will see quiz results when you finish all of the questions, as you submit each question or once the quiz deadline has passed. Also notice in the quiz navigation on the right, there are two rectangles with a number representing each question that you can use to navigate to each question in the quiz. In this case, there are only two quiz questions, so there are only two rectangles on the right hand screen. This is helpful if there are a lot of questions and you want to return to one of the questions by clicking on it in the quiz navigation area. Answer each quiz question. For some quiz question types, you will need to click submit to ensure your answer is recorded and for others you will simply navigate through the quiz and it will automatically save your answers. If there's a submit button, be sure you select that or a save button. You are now ready to finish your attempt. The screen shows that my answers are saved. I could return to the attempt and continue to work on the quiz or I can submit all and finish. You will be asked to confirm that you want to submit all and finish. Depending on the settings selected by your instructor, you may see feedback and data about your test session at the top of the screen. In this case, I can see the test date when I started, when I finished, how long it took me to take the quiz, and what my score is on the quiz. In addition, it shows me that I missed question one and that's indicated by the red X next to the answer that I selected. The second question I got correct and it shows a green check mark next to the, my answer. I can finish the review down here at the bottom by selecting finish review. And if more than one attempt is allowed, I could reattempt the quiz if I didn't like the score that I got the first time. So that's it. Thank you for joining me on how to take a quiz in Moodle.